Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the spooktacular game of Dreadout. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna proceed onward. I forgot what we were doing. But we were definitely look. At, oh my God, it's a kitty cat. Hey, you the same kitty cat from before? Kitty cat, kitty cat, kitty cat. Oh, I got an achievement for taking a picture of Key Cat. Alright. Let's go in here. Okay, so we are... I have no idea what we are doing. Guess we are looking for something. Um. Oh, this is where... Okay, hang on. This is where... Like, it kept telling me there's like a... Something here. I will find it. It says use F for the flash, but... Cat, you just gotta not do that, okay, buddy? Just gotta not freak me out here. I don't get it, because it's telling me there's something here, but I'm... I'm lost as what that is. But maybe it's in this room over here. Because it gets nice and bright right here. But I don't, I don't see it. The ground flip freaks out. The walls freak out. Everything's just like going crazy. You'd think maybe one of these pictures, but no, I guess not. All right, let's go. I mean, I'm thoroughly confused as to what this one. And look at that face. Okay, look, I'm taking pictures of everything. And, uh, vinaigrette powers are failing me. Miserably. Hi, buddy. Alright, you've been, like, doing some serious running through this hallway. That creeps me out the most, that, like... Everything, like, appears later. Alright, so we just walked in a circle. Um, I don't know what to do. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Could be in the men's bathroom, right? No, because vinaigrette powers are happening. It's vignette, but I like calling it vinaigrette powers. They're happening in here. Ugh, like, okay. Go into every stall. There's water. No, no water. What? What is it? What are you trying to tell me? Is there some sort of secret I don't know about? A plunger? A broom? Alright. No, I don't know. Don't necessarily want to go mess with the pig. Alright, there's a kitty cat. I get that, Mr. Kitty Cat. I get it. Alright. Whoa. I don't like music that does that to me. I know you are near. You'll never take my baby. Never. What the hell is that cowbell? Hmm. I, this is weird. Loud chiming noises scaring me a little bit. Not gonna lie. Don't even know what we're doing. Hmm. There's that whoop whoop noise again. What what am I doing? Like, why are you making loud noises at me? Alright, um, I might have to go back downstairs, I guess. I need to go fight the piggy. I hope that piggy doesn't come for me. Reincarnated Grand Assembly. Oh, what the? Okay, well, um, we got a Ghostopedia. Let's figure out what that was. Okay, so, um, Sirupa, get info. 
a dark being who roams the world bearing the promise of immortality. He manifests the faces of those who are willing to sacrifice themselves. Hmm. Gotta get around the piggy. Okay. Alright, vinaigrette powers activated yet again. Oh, could be on the table. Hmm. There's a cat, there's a pig. I mean, this place just gets more and more interesting. Okay, I wish I could uh get squeeze in. No? Alright. I I'm just a little bit lost here. Oh jeez. Alright. E. The town isn't monotonous, monotonous and is it appeared to be apparently they've got their own designated holiday. There was a lavish festival with vibrant music, dancing, and plenty of food to go around. Everyone seemed to be enjoying themselves. It was pretty incredible. However, one thing did puzzle me. During the ritual with animal sacrifice, I could have sworn I heard screaming, though I can't really be sure with all the old, loud trumpets and drums. I probably just imagined it. No one else seemed to notice anyways. Well, these notes are cool and all, but does it help me at all with anything at all? Hmm. This is where all these random noises and clues are appearing that I can't figure out, but let's take a look at the ring we got. Maybe that will solve the mystery of whatever it is. And I've got to just rub my eyes real quick because it's morning and I want to. The object is flowing with mystical energy. So helpful. Clue is like heavily inside this door. So we're going in. Okay. There it is. Jesus. A local high school was taken by surprise yesterday as a whole classroom of students suddenly entered a state of trance. At 10 a.m. as Miss Estrid was teaching geography to her class, a few students screaming kicked their desks. A minute later, every student in class was screaming and acting erratically. She called for help immediately after they began to speaking in tongues. The school headmaster had announced the incident was in fact a mass possession of the students by supernatural beings. I'm glad that the, uh, the, uh, pre uh the headmaster of school somehow knew mass possession uh, not not just you know a joke uh, the whole class of 2a was hurriedly taken to the nearest public infirmary for treatment a local medical team treated the students while a professional witch doctor performed an exorcism eyewitnesses said that all the students regained consci consciousness simultaneously at 3 p.m. well these notes are cool and they have a great story But the problem is, is not just the story, but the, um, it's just what do I do? The school's open and, like, free for me to explore and random noises occur, which bug me. They definitely bug me. So, Okay, so the clue in here is no longer here. So the game definitely doesn't determine, like, whether you can see the clo clue <laughs> high or low. Kitty cat. I get it. Loud cowbell noises. It's supposed to signify something. Okay. So, I mean, you could see that, and you could see all of that, but I don't know what any of that means. It's just a dead end. I I'm seriously thinking that the pig has something important. Oh. Is 
So that must be a boss or something in there. I, I'm just, I'm thinking aloud that the boss should, maybe. Yes, kitty cat, I can hear you bitching out there. Um. Hey, you know what, boys and girls? I think I'm going to go look it up. I'm, I'm pretty lost, so let's figure out where I'm going to be, and then I'll be right back. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. I just realized my hair was totally out of whack because I totally forgot when I wake up stuff. And, it, like, I didn't know, realize I even looked partially bald, like, right here. But, hey, hair's thinning out. I'm getting old. Whatever. Anyways, I spent, like, the last God knows how long um, trying to find a um, guide. And there's nothing. There's nothing. I, I'm so shocked nobody has done a written guide on this game. So, what I'm going to do here is, uh... What I saw in the video I had watched is the guy actually fought the pig. So that's what we're going to do. Catch your breath. Are you done, you done breathing heavily? We're going to need to run here shortly. Now, hang on. There was something here that she was able to take a picture of but I need to get a picture of the pig like that's gotta happen take that piggy there we go there we go alright so we got an objective update that's the bathroom I got molested in okay we gotta i get up the stairs real quick while I get my objectives, figure out what's going on. Alright, so that's about all I got from the video, was you were supposed to take, like, a whole bunch of pictures of the damn pig. Someone who gained wealth through the practice of black magic. In their wild hog form, they are able to drain money from surrounding houses, which amasses near the current location. Gosh, you're so ugly. David Cameron, is that you? <laughs> I had to make the joke at least once. The keys are dangling on the neck of the hideous boar beast. There should be a way to cut them loose. Well, I don't have, like, a knife or anything, but I didn't... I also didn't explore that very well um, over here because he kept being a goober douche and, um, yeah, made life difficult. Let's see. Whoa. Hey. This is a pretty big room. the other side. Alright, piggy. I'm gonna come beat you up. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. Alright, ganglot. An authentic jenglot. I don't know what jenglot. I, or, or it's, yeah, I don't know how to pronounce these. Please forgive me. I know culture is another thing that I'm not familiar with familiar with, so forgive me. Do you want to be rich? Do you want to have success? Do you long for love in your life? An authentic jenglot has growing hairs and nails. I don't know what that means exactly, to be honest. Oh, I was already out. Okay. Now, where's the pig at? I'm trying to go around the corner, but the camera keeps messing up on me. Hey, little bastard. I want the keys on your neck. Oh, you see me? Oh, aren't you a do Boom! Come here, come here. Get another picture. Boom! Get another picture. Oh, he pile drive me. Oh, he's so tiny. Uh, look at him go. Oh, he's so cute. So adorable. He can go. Okay. Where'd he go? He's gotta be here. What the hell? Where'd he go? 
Damn it! I was so close! What the hell was that? The F was that? Little piggy sleeping. His trouble's away. I kinda want the keys on his neck. I don't have a knife or anything. God, where'd he go? Open a door. Go in a new room? No, same room. Go in here, you old ghost wall walking pig. And he is sleeping his troubles away. Come on. Of course, the door is locked. And of course, he's sleeping behind the locked door. Okay, so keys dangling around the neck of a hideous board beast. There should be a way to cut them loose. Ah. Uh, okay, so does the game want to give me like a knife? Maybe I could use a knife. I could cut things with a knife. This video might be particularly long due to all the wackiness in my crazy ass hair. Sorry about my hair right now. I don't even know how it looks. Hopefully, it's crazy ass. I like. It. I don't put gel in it in the morning. Cause, yeah, crazy hair. But, um, yeah, no. Um, oh, the piggy's already back. He's done sleeping. How am I gonna cut it from his neck? I and mean, he pretty much just becomes a big baby when it comes to freaking fighting. He bulldozes his way past me. actually kind of scary to fight him because I have to wait between camera shots to actually hurt him. Now, I've opened every classroom door I possibly could. A knife so far has yet to be a validated weapon here. Oh, what is this? I just want to make sure he's not going to come and give me the... the hell? What, what, where's the enemy? Is he out there? No. But there's an enemy here for sure. That is the enemy. Come on, baby. It goes right through her. Can't, can't. Can't take a picture yet? <laughs> what? <laughs> yummy, yummy, I guess. There should be a knife or something around here, maybe. More glitching in the wall. Damn, this game's so glitchy. Definitely haven't been over here yet. Hmm. New door. Door's locked. I mean, I hear the pig, but where? Am I in a new side of this ta uh, the school I haven't been on? I mean, I must be. Did I cause some sort of new event, maybe? I don't know. Maybe I should have finished watching that walkthrough guide. I just didn't want to ruin things for me, because if things actually get scary, I want to be scared. That fucking cat. There's a kitty cat again. Toilet noises. Alright, boys and girls, I, I really gotta. 
I gotta try to figure this out. I'll be right back one more time. Hello, everybody. I'm back again. Um, I think I finally uh, found what I was looking for as far as um, this whole thing was concerned. Um, they showed me there was an area you could take a picture, which I find a little ridiculous. You come over here, you stand here, and you know, I saw this, but I didn't know you did, had to stand like this and do that. There's something about this picture. Look in the picture, there's a key at the bottom. You can't find the key without the picture's bullcrap. Key dangling on the neck of the hideous that should cut him loose, yeah, so that's clearly... Okay, I know what to do. I know what to do now. There, there's a key. And then we gotta go downstairs, we gotta fight the piggy again. Again, because, you know, fighting him many times we've already done it, it's not enough. Hi, giddy. Hi, giddy. Anyway, so, yeah, with all that being said, now that I know what to do... Piggy better be down this side. Take a few deep breaths, girly, you're gonna need it. Seem like the pig's down this side again. Or am I on the wrong? Oh, I'm on the wrong side of the school. Oops. Yeah, so it's like the reason that this game is so hard for me to figure out is just nothing is coming together as a whole. Like, just, ooh, superstitious stuff. And, um, you know, the stuff you have to do to get all this is like, it just doesn't hit me as, oh, I know what to do. Like, I found a key, unlocks a door. It's more like I have to find a hidden place to take a picture which then reveals a key to which then I need to go find to open a door to lead to somewhere else and I don't know it's just if I ever have to do the whole like find objects to unlock new paths it's got to be self-explanatory it's got to give me more than just figure out what to do oh, I got a picture from that distance holy crap Back it up. Back it up. Are you glitched? Oh, well, now, now he's scared of me. Alright, so I need him to run because the area I gotta go to is, uh... Okay. The area I have to go to is where back over here. Back where I've already explored. So while he sleeps, now I will go grab the key needed. Because actually, so far, what I need is actually has nothing to do with the pig. It's like over here somewhere. Isn't it over here? And then this is about all I saw up to, so... Um, oh wait, no, I, I saw a little more. I saw where to put the key. He's somewhere here. I know it is. Somewhere over the rainbow way up high. Come on. Hey, I want to find this freaking key. Okay, hold on. Let's take a look at the little freaking picture. See, see where it's at. Let's see. I like how there's already a hole in the wall and there's just this... It's not a very good way for me to see things. There's a hole in the wall. Gotta find the other hole in the wall. I was really skipping through that video. I didn't want anything spoiled if possible. But you know, that's not always possible. I just know it's somewhere around here. It's not further ahead, that's a dead end. Uh, we already know it's not in here, I'm just walking in circles now. God damn it. Uh, blah, blah, blah. you're in here somewhere. What are you, Mr. Key? Why isn't blue vinegar act acting up now? What the hell? Alright, blue vinegar, it's gotta be somewhere. Biggie, you sleep, you sleep your troubles away. I've got to figure out where the hell this key is. Ah, 
man, this game is like Fatal Frame was kind of kind of direct on what the items did, you know, when you got an item, and whatnot. All right, so the blue vinaigrette is occurring around here, so I gotta be close, right? It's gotta be in this classroom. No. Is it upstairs, maybe? I don't know. It's in one of the classrooms with a hole in the wall. Just like, oh my goodness. If I skip around, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I just don't feel like doing a two hour video of me trying to figure out where the hell key should have been. I can't get. No, I'm in the wrong area. Hmm. Let's cut to the other side, I guess. Let me just go this way. I mean, the funny thing is, too, in this guide video when I was skipping through it, I realized I found things faster than the person in the guide. Um, and like I said, the one thing that makes no sense to me is... Uh, one thing that makes no sense to me is, uh, like, how anyone's supposed to figure this out, because I, I just don't see how this is supposed to be an easy figure. Because I'm trying to figure this out, and I, I'm, I'm unlocking everything, opening everything. And it's just, the clues aren't there for me to understand what I'm really supposed to be doing. Keys in here? No? It's in a classroom with a hole in it, I know that much. Like, we got that much. Keys in here, maybe? No. Nope. Oh, man, I, I should should have watched that video thoroughly. That way I wouldn't waste my time running around here. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Where's the pig at? Get back. Back. The old bastard. Jeez. Man, you trust that pig for just a second, he's waiting on the stairway for you. You little douchebag. That door's locked? Alright, so it's gotta be in here. If I'm not mistaken, the, the picture is of a hole in the wall and it's just tucked under a desk. Doesn't that look beautiful? Okay, so I need to find a hole in the wall with like a partial window. Hole in the wall, partial window. Oh, it's this. It's in here. For sure. Is that it? Because that's, that's where it's at, right? Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Where is it? I want to I want to actually see the key before I pick it up. Where? Where is it? Do not tell me it is No. No. I I, w I refuse to accept that an invisible key is in the corner here and I knew to walk there. No. 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 This game See, and this is what I mean, like, you had to take a picture of the location on the ceiling in a specific spot to reveal a key was in the classroom when the girls hung themselves, and then you had to go find out where that kind of wall is and go to a random corner, and your blue vinaigrette powers don't even work. What's the point of having them if they don't even work on important things like that? God damn. Catch your breath. Catch your breath. Alright, so now what the key is for, what I saw to use it on, was uh, 
certain door. Uh, not door, it's actually the cl locked closet where the cowbells are. And you take the locked closet and you open it and stuff happens. Uh, all I know is like there's a door behind that, I guess. I don't know. I have no, I really have no idea. I, I like, I'm, ugh, this game is so, it's like less scary because I am working too hard to try to figure out what exactly to do and nothing is happening while I'm doing that. It drives me nuts. I have to go all the way around. So I don't even know what my HP, oh, the battery life is my HP. I guess there's no way to recover that either. So I'm probably gonna be flubbernucked. Not even gonna lie. So, should be over in this one. Should be this right here. All right. This is about as much of the video, and then I was like, oh, okay, I can figure the rest out. Well, I ain't that spoopy. All right, what? Well, where's my vinaigrette powers telling me to go? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, that's a dead baby. Oh, the, oh. Oh, she's gonna give me the snips. Oh, that is creepy shit. <laughs> You're gonna get snipped! Oh my god, yours. <laughs> Miss Snips, let's dance, bitch. Bring it, Miss Snips. Oh, I got snipped! Okay, look, I know she's snipping me, I get it. But I'm taking pictures of Miss Snips. Oh shit. Ah, I got you, Miss Snips! Snip, snip! Jeez. Oh, come on! I took like 40 pictures of her! Oh my god. Wow, oh, she's getting crazy on me. I'm actually kind of like terrified of this girl. Oh. Okay. Miss Snips, did you drop your scissors? Oh, <gasps> Miss Snips gave me scissors. Creepiest baby ever. All right, so we got Ghostopedia. Let's see what Miss Snips really was. Scissors Phantom. You couldn't call her Miss Snips. Like Snip Snip. Oh. <laughs> All right, a high school principal who was driven mad by the grief over her. His deceased ba- That was a dude? Later in life, he adopted a doll to replace the child which he protects even in death. He can even be seen guarding his secret room turned nursery. A place he designed to be safe for his baby from the threat of a Kuntilan- Kuntilanak? Kuntilanak. Kuntilanak. An entity to believe- to be responsible for his child's death. Okay, it was actually Mr. Snips dressed as Miss Snips. That's the only thing I can think of that did it. But now the problem is um, I may have scissors to cut the keys off the freaking pig's neck, but the problem is 
if I take too many pictures of the piggy, he runs away. And that room is currently locked. Hi, Geekat. So cute. And let me see if I got any pictures of Mr. Snips. Oh, so beautiful. I'm putting that one in the gallery. Let's see. Can't forget the baby. I'm going to add that one to the gallery. Oh, look! Mr. Snips came back from his vacation. Yeah, no, not a good one. Oh, something's distracting Mr. Snips with his invisible scissors. We're taking that one. Uh, no. No, no, you're looking fabulous, Mr. Snips. Fabulous. Surprised. Caught off guard. <laughs> All right, Mr. Snips, thank you for playing. Well, I mean, that was a boss, wasn't it? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we've been playing for so long, I think it's about time that I end the video here. Um, we beat the first boss. I mean, I think that was a boss. He snipped me pretty hard. Um, but as I better get to a safe spot. Yeah, because classrooms are safe. But anyways, um, I, I'm going until I beat the game. So thank you, everybody, for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And as always, good game.